If you were like the thousands who headed to the Magic Game here at the Amway Center tonight, chances are you may have noticed that your favorite parking spot is no longer there. Early season wins. Go Magic. Have Magic fans flocking to the stands. Come on, go Magic! <laughs> on four wheels or just three. But new city plans are making the hike from the car to the Amway Center a little longer. Maybe a block and a half. So maybe four long blocks. That's a good walk. Yes. What once was parking lot 9 South, now a closed off construction site. As city officials move forward with the Under Eye, a park that will stretch from Church Street to Washington. Do you think if you were able to park in this old spot, just two blocks over, that would have been a little easier? Oh yes, definitely. There are still places close by to park, but they'll cost you. I parked in the Geico parking lot. A price of twenty dollars. I'm here with my daughter, who's going to be part of the chorus singing the national anthem, and so I wanted to make sure that after the game, after, hopefully after the Magic win, then uh, we'll be able to uh, safely get to our car. Others found parking a little cheaper. We went down the street, walk over, saw ten dollars, just pulled in there. But it was first come, first serve. The Church Street station lot, another popular option, completely full prior to tip off. Oh yes, it was already filling up. Much of the under eye parking has been moved to various parking garages in the area. The Geico garage is the closest for just $20 a car. Reporting in downtown Orlando, Heather Gustafson, Fox 35 News.